Hey, what's going on guys? Mike from the Retro Electors. And today we're going to be talking about my favorite game in the Kirby series, and that's Kirby's Dream Land. Kirby has been a long-standing Nintendo character, being featured in over 30 games over the last 30 years. But it all started with this, Kirby's Dream Land. Kirby's Dream Land showcased a pink blob that swallowed enemies and spit them out as projectiles. You can't make this stuff up. Over the years, Kirby's lore has changed from a lovable pink piece of chewing gum to a god-slaying super being. Take that, Mario. My first time playing Kirby's Dream Land, it was in 1992. I was 12 years old and I absolutely loved this gameplay and design of Kirby. His animation and pre-level showcase really made him feel like a living, breathing character that has been just living his day-to-day -day life. Its overall simplicity and quick learning curve made it accessible for anyone. You can even complete it in one sitting. But once you do, be prepared for the ability to play extra games. Basically the same game with swapped out enemies that are quicker and change their attack patterns. 